Hey everyone, welcome to a new video. I'm Holly and this is a new video. So as you may or may not know, everyone is going back to school. It's quite exciting. I'm not, because I'm 25. Been there, done that. But maybe you haven't. Maybe this is your first year at high school. And I just realized my calendar still says August. I should probably fix that. So yeah, school's, school's happening. In today's video, I want to talk to you about how to have a really good year at school. So here, here's uh, some things you can do. First off, wear whatever you want. It's high school. People are like, oh, I need to have this and that. Why don't you just wear what makes you feel comfortable? I did. Maybe now it's a fashion regret. Yeah, it's definitely a fashion regret, but it's freaking high school. You're just going to look back and be like, it's a fashion regret pretty much no matter what you do. So, so wear what makes you happy. Take a fun snack every day. My mom pretty much packed my lunch through most of high school. <laughs> And it would always pack something fun. And if it's you back in your lunch, take something fun like, like one of those mini Mars bars or like cookies or I don't know, maybe you really like applesauce, take some of that. But take a really fun snack so when you know you have your, your, your break, you can look forward to having that one snack. Don't be afraid to take strange courses. I know you've probably already picked all your courses for this semester, but maybe you haven't picked them for next semester. I, I recommend you take the weirdest stuff. Maybe you kind of want to, but a little bit scared, just do it. Just do it and you might end up really, really liking it. That's what I did. I took everything. I remember there was one year where I took like auto and I had fashion and communication. So I was making videos and then go and, and then fashion and then I'd go to auto. So sometimes I would like knit in my auto class and I learned to change, change oil in cars. So it was great. Stay active. I know high school can be like, I went to school all day and then you get home and you don't want to do anything. You should probably just stay as active as possible, stay healthy, it'll help you in the long run. Maybe go for a bike ride, go for a walk, do any of that kind of stuff. Like 20 minutes, that's all you need. You could also do this by maybe joining a sports team, which leads me into my next thing, join a club or something. This is one thing I regret not doing in school. I played rugby and I wasn't very good at it, but that's the only thing I did. And yes, you should probably do that. And uh, I know it's kind of scary, but definitely Take the leap and jump out of your comfort zone because it'll be well worth it in the end. Um, the next thing is to keep an open mind because that's important in high school. Um, to not, you know, dismiss anything, to uh, take as much in as you possibly can because there's going to be a lot going on. You're going to meet a lot of new people with a lot of different views on things. And keeping an open mind will keep you like open to everything and uh, will we'll serve you better as you get older. The next tip is to not worry about what people think of you. Now this is tricky to do. I struggle with it. Sometimes I still struggle with it. It's just one of those things. It's kind of like almost throughout school, it gets built into us to worry about what other people think. In the grand scheme of things, what they think really doesn't matter. It doesn't. It's not like 20 years from now, you're gonna see them again and it's gonna affect you just then. If anything, they'll be like, I remember you did this in high school. And be like, well, that was like 20 years ago. Who cares? Oh, they're still talking about it and they're still stuck in high school. You've moved on. I wouldn't worry about it too much. Even today, I'll be like, you know, dancing in my car and then I'll stop when I get to like a corner because I'm worried what people are going to think. And then I'm like, but when am I ever going to see these people again? I'm never going to see them again. Why do I not just enjoy myself like dancing in my car? They're, I'm not going to see them again. And if I do, what am I going to say? I saw you dancing in your car. Look like you're having a good time. Because I was. I was having a great time. And you didn't ruin it for me because I wasn't thinking about what you were thinking about. Um, make sure you have a really good breakfast. People always say, you know, breakfast is the most important meal of the day, and I will agree. I've never missed a breakfast because it's delicious and I love it. Cereal's good. I highly recommend like a like a an oatmeal because that's that gets you where you need to be. Avoid sugary cereals. I know I'm like giving health stuff now, but this is just it's just general advice. Avoid Lucky Charms. Another thing is don't be afraid to ask for help. The teachers get paid to help you. Now, that, with that being said, not all teachers are built the same. Not all teachers are there for the same reason. Some are there just because they get a, the summer off. They don't really care. I've met those teachers. They do not care. Or if they do care, they pick favorite students and are total jerks to the rest. Um, you're going to run into those. But you're also going to run into teachers that actually give a shit. And I recommend you talk to them. Even if maybe they're not like... So you're having trouble with math and your favorite teacher is the English teacher. Talk to the English teacher. Say you're having problems with the math teacher. I'm sure they will find a way to help you out, whether it's find another teacher or maybe they talk to that teacher. I don't know, but asking for help has never been a bad thing. And finally, have as much fun as possible. It's high school. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. I hope it was kind of helpful and I hope it made you like less worried about school if you're worried about school because you probably shouldn't be worried about school. And remember to ask for help. Anyway, thank you for watching and I'll talk to you real soon.